The shoes express a lot of attitude, so I wanted a location and a model that also had that attitude. Move it closer. I'm shooting a job for the international shoe brand. They need new campaign images for the season. I started last week in my studio, shooting the pack shots. For that I use my D2 model lights. They're not only great for action, but also ideal for pack shots. They have great color stability, which makes them reliable. My lighting setup was simple. I used a light table with two D2s on each side, each with a strip softbox. Angle around 45 degrees towards the subject, and then a D2 from above with a white beauty dish. That gives a nice softened but crisp light on the shoes, which makes them really pop. Looks good. Can we take another one? Yeah. You might think shooting simple objects like shoes is easy. But shooting pack shots is an intense job that requires a lot of precision. So I'm glad to now finally get outside and go on location. I'm on my way to Herringer Castle, south of Stockholm. One of the most beautiful photo locations I know in the area. It's a dreamy place with a lot of history. Most of the owners have had minor or major delusions of grandeur. And a love for decadence, glamour and parties. I will incorporate that feel into my image, with reference to the craziness from The Great Gatsby. The big job for the campaign is to set a hero shot that my client will use on big billboards. The shoes express a lot of attitude. So I wanted a location and a model that also had that attitude. Okay, let's do this. We have this amazing dress, the amazing let's, shoes. You're gonna sit by the pool. Okay. You will put these exclusive shoes in the water actually and like splash them like this. Okay. <laughs> and we'll get the, like the water drops. Yeah. Just freeze yeah, around really. it. Yeah. I love the idea. Like gracefully crazy. Yeah. <laughs> The trick will be to overpower the strong sun, but also have enough speed to freeze the water splashes in pin-sharp detail. For this setup, I'm using a 1000 watt D2 with a deep umbrella XL. A silver version angled from the right so it hits her back. I'm shooting in high-speed sync, which enables me to get the flash to expose at higher shutter speeds. This makes it possible to freeze the motion of the water around her shoes. My first idea for the shoot was to have the model jump or fall into the pool head first, then freeze her shoes sticking up from the waterline. But I'm very happy we went in this direction. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> yeah, it would be nice to have the legs a little bit more mm -hmm. in line. But I think yeah. I like that the head is nicer when it's... Yeah, a little I believe we got a sophisticated, yeah. yet edgy pose, with the shoes elegantly displayed, but with a twist. The water. Wow. All the details are beautiful in the shoes with the water. It's so sharp here. Yeah, yeah. Well, it looks so yeah. easy. Can see we got it exactly off. as I saw the image in my head. And it won't need much pose. And then you, at you the same the... time, her skin is really soft the yeah. way you want it. Yeah. With the lighting, it feels almost perfect. You're straight out of my camera. I'm, I'm so happy. <laughs> <laughs> Good. There's been a lot of elements to this campaign. It was a prestigious job. And it's always a thrill to see you work in real life 